Ian, a 2-2 draw with Stockport County this afternoon. What's your overall assessment of the game? Um, good workout, I think, for both teams. Um, some positives, some negatives. Um, but yeah, a, a good game. A uh, difficult game because they're used to winning Stockport. They've, they've just been promoted and carry momentum. So, yeah, I thought a lot of it was, was good. And some lots of good bits, but we're still progressing in pre-season. We're managing the minutes. The players are still fatigued. Uh, the teams are more or less split evenly, so yeah, lots of good work. Quite a tight game after an hour, goalless of course. Do you think that could well have been different if we had shown a little bit more ruthlessness in their box? Yeah, I think we had really good chances first half, um, Backer in particular, but our play to get there was excellent. And then that's just the stage of the season we're at, it's just that sharpness and composure in front of goal, which will come naturally as, as pre-season progresses. But, um, as I said, the, the play to get there was, was excellent. Two really well taken goals as well, especially the second one from Connor Bradley. He's, he's come on and, and done really well today. Yeah, we're pleased with Connor. Um, the reason we recruited him is because he fits our identity and our idea of how we want to play. Um, fantastic pass from George Johnston and a wonderful touch and finish. And yeah, he's, he's hit the ground running, but we expected him to. Um, but we must manage expectations. He's a young player that you know, we think has got a really bright future. But at the minute, we just head down and work hard, and, and hopefully the fans will see the fruits of that start of the season. And 3-3 three and three for Elias Kachunga, a really bright start to pre-season yeah. for him. Yeah, I think all the front lads are doing well. Um, we're asking them to work a little bit harder out of possession, and they've really bought into that. Um, and catches scored 3-3. Three three. I think backers work has been excellent, created some good opportunities today. Um, we've got Dion and Yon who have been scoring goals, and they're playing really well as well. So, yeah, Dapo, he, He's, he's doing great in that number 10 role, so look, we've got some really good attackers. Um, for now, it's keep them in one piece and, and look at utilising our options against different types of opposition. Obviously, in the first two pre-season games, it was split 45 minutes each, but today, how pleasing was it to see that first 11 get through the hour? Because I guess a lot of pre-season, of course, is about getting fitter and fitter. Exactly that. As I said, we're, we're monitoring the minutes, and the ones that didn't play an hour today will, will play an hour in the next pre-season game. So, yeah, we're building up our fitness and our sharpness and there's lots of positives to be had. Yeah, can you see the group getting fitter and fitter as each week goes by and each game goes by, not only in the games but day to day on the training ground as well? Absolutely. And as I said, the, the train, uh, the plane, sorry, overloaded at the moment. Their legs have had to work really hard, but we want it to be that case because they'll, they'll benefit from that fitness work later on in the season. But for now, it's, it's getting those miles into the legs. There's no easy way. They just have to work hard, but their attitude's been excellent. And again today they've shown us good energy, good attitude and we'll progress the minutes as we go along.